hello all of you welcome back to my channel so in this video i'll be explaining you about testing of cement but before that let's uh, have a look on physical properties of cement so physical properties are generally used to categorize or classify your portland cement so some of the physical properties are determined using uh, dry cement alone and some of the physical properties are determined using cement paste and some of the physical properties are determined using mortar so uh, along with the one form of cement we cannot determine all the physical properties we have to change its form to know various types of properties of the cement so if you can observe in the flow chart physical properties are basically done uh, on three variants of cement or three forms of cement one is the dry cement next is the cement paste and next one is the mortar so if you see the dry cement we have two tests that which uh, that we can perform on dry cement the cement powder which is fineness test in the sense we can determine fineness property and also specific gravity property we can determine once you observe uh, the second uh, one which is cement paste so using cement paste we can determine the properties like soundness and setting time and when coming to the motor so why motor has come into place why because uh, handing of cement paste is little bit difficult and hence there will be strength variations or result variation in the test hence we are using a mortar so mortar is cement paste plus sand so we prepare a mortar and then we try to test the compressive strength and from this compressive strength physical property only we can determine the grade of the cement okay coming to the testing of cement so as just now told you various physical properties of cement so what all those physical properties you want to determine then you have to test the cement so testing of cement is of both ways uh, one is field testing and laboratory testing uh, whatever uh, way you are doing means either a field testing or a laboratory testing both of them are used to ensure the quality of the cement so field tests are generally carried out on the work site and no sophisticated or hi-fi equipment or any special apparatus is required so one has to have a good experience and experience plays an important role in the assessment of observations in the field which is used for qualitative assessment of the cement and laboratory test requires special equipment and also special apparatus and quantitatively one has to evaluate the properties of cement the assessment of the quality of the cement is carried out by comparing lab test results with the values given in respective is codes and hence uh, one has to collect the sample of cement and then do a proper field testing but field testing does not give you the accurate results as told accurate assessment is not possible and hence one has to go for the laboratory testing so let's get into field testing of cement the first point what we can observe in field testing or what one has to do in the process of field testing means open the bag of cement and take a good look at the cement you when you are looking at the cement you shouldn't find any visible nodules or lumps and also the color of the cement should be the regular color like uh, whatever greenish gray or gray color of cement whatever we say the same color you should be able to find there should be no darker color nor lighter color next try to insert your hand thrust your hand into the cement bag just try to insert your hand into the cement bag once you insert your hand into the cement bag you must get a very cool feeling so if you are getting a cool feeling it means that the cement is fresh also when you are inserting your hand you cannot you shouldn't get in touch with any lumps inside and then another test what you can do in field is just take a pinch of cement put it in between your fingers and try to press it so if it is giving a very smooth feeling then it means that the cement is good it should not give you any gritty feeling means if the cement is mixed up with any impurities you get a a gritty feeling a rough feeling in between your hands next one is just take a handful of cement put it in a bucket of water if uh, the cement particles before submerging inside 
should float for a while then it means that the cement is fresh so we can see uh, the point which I was telling take cement in between your fingers and try to feel it so these are the field testing we can do okay next comes our laboratory testing but why I will not discuss laboratory testing in this video because I am happy to tell you that I will be opening a new playlist regarding concrete technology and highway materials lab. So there obviously I need to explain the uh, testing of cement in the laboratory. Hence I will be covering the laboratory test there. Okay. So we have various types of laboratory tests like fineness test, specific gravity test, setting times, soundness and compression strength. So all of them we will be discussing in the next playlist which I will be starting very soon. Okay. So thank you so much for watching the video.